Good day viewers and welcome to Clearview Television Newspaper Review, where you get direct insights into matters happening within Nigeria and around the world. For today, the 20th of December 2023, I am your presenter, Favor Serial. We start out this review with Daily Trust Newspaper with their lead angle, Rivers Crisis, Tinubu's Intervention Breach of Constitution, CSAN. Supporting stories include six political solutions can't override law. Clark says President's actions insult to Rivers people. Fubara, we will sacrifice for peace. PDP rejects truce, insists on fresh pool. Protest in protocols over truce. Content of the story can be found on the front page and subsequently on page 4. To your bottom left, you find Web probes NDAs over fronts to tackle out of school students' minions. Content of the story will be found on page 5. And beneath that, after shake up, lobby for aviation headships begin. You find content of the story on page 26 and on page 23. Zenny Bank listed among 100 top global companies for 2023. Daily Trust Fund paid also holds a picture of President Bola Hamed Tinimbo and the CEO of Total Energy, Patrick Proyone. Beneath that picture, we see Naira Scarcity, NLC warns federal government sees CBN insight in Nigeria. If you turn your eyes to the far right of Daily Trust newspaper, ill at 14 years after Akira Dolu calls for Yara Dubas' regulations, aunt him. Content of the story will be found on page 3 and on page 8, traditional ruler, pregnant wife, 15 others abducted in Taraba. And finally on page 6, we find a promotional story, peace and harmony have returned to the EFCC. That's all we have on Daily Trust today. Can you pick up a copy to brush you? Next on our list, we have the Guidance newspaper, uh, who has their front page clustered with pictures and graphs. But with the lead story, despite 9.56 trillion naira allocation in five years, 774 local governments still underdeveloped. Now, there's a chart showing their locations in five years to so this local government and still on the chat you see state government hijack funds functions of local council stakeholders seek scrap of joint accounts and allocation committee while opposition parties are non-existent in grassroots tell the number truth not what he hears at villa fire me advises ganduji content of the story will be found on page three and beneath their chat we see bandit adult police officers monarch pregnant woman dating others in taraba we find the story on page 29 and on page 15. telecoms may lose subscribers as ncc orders total ban of unleaked sims Police in Anambra nabs couples who bought month old baby for 30,000 naira. Content of the story will be found on page 8 and on page 6. Falano Clark, Weaver's Elder, slams Tinubu's unconstitutional peace deal. And to your bottom, you find NRC flees federal government over cash scarcity, seeks liquidity to meet demands. Details of the story will be found on page 3. That's all we have on Guidance newspaper. For more details, kindly pick up a copy of the Guidance and browse too. And for more updates, kindly like, share, subscribe and follow us on all our social media platforms at Clearview Television. Thank you.